Welcome back. It's 446. Imagine an opportunity during the pandemic to be hired for a job on the spot. The Bakersfield Behavioral Health Care Hospital needs a new batch of workers. 23 ABC's Kristen Vartan has has more on the jobs they intend to fill. A lot of people who have experienced or, or participated in job fairs, it's it, they're huge. There's a lot going on and you're lucky to get maybe a five minute conversation with somebody at a booth. Not at this job fair. The director of business development at Bakersfield Behavioral Healthcare Hospital, Amber Smithson, says that you'll be interviewed right then and there and possibly hired for one of their 20 available full time and per diem positions, too. Here's what's on the table. RNs, mental health workers, which are entry level positions that don't require a degree and pays about 14 an hour, as Glassdoor reports, and diet aid positions. This demand, Smithson explains, comes due to a surge in children and adolescents needing their services. It also comes from vacant positions opening up because of the pandemic. You lose some staff, you gain some staff, some staff is pulled to help with med surge hospitals. And so we, we find ourselves like a lot of other hospitals and a lot of other medical uh, professions where we're in dire need of you know, qualified, dedicated people that want to join our team. And sure, prior experience may help you get the job, but ultimately, what behavioral health is looking for beyond the resume is empathy. For mental health workers, for example, heart is needed, Smithson says, as they're assisting mental health patients directly with their daily needs. Skills can always be taught, right? But your empathy and your compassion for our population is, is a lot harder to teach. Although not required, she says that it would be helpful if they have some sort of prior psych work experience or worked as a patient aide at a facility. The job fair is January 21st from 2 to 6 p.m. at their gym, which Smithson says gives plenty of space to space out. They're also limiting how many people can be there at a time. Masks are required, resumes encouraged. More information can be found on our website, turn to 23com In Bakersfield, Kristen Varton, 23ABC News, connecting you.